Yeah, I want to get some better light on this guy. He's just trying to sun. He's just trying to get him some sun. Or her. <laughs> Howdy folks, Sean here from Hiking with Sean on YouTube. And today I am hiking the Cedar Grove area uh, of River River Trail, probably in between Cedar Grove and uh, Eddyville area. I'm gonna go check out Crow Knob. Maybe try to find Miller Grove Community and Cemetery because I know it's somewhere out here. And just check around little other things, see what's going on out here. So stay tuned for, for some fun video. And if you're not a subscriber, please hit that subscribe button today. It's free and it really helps me out. Alrighty folks, here we are at Crow Knob Ecological Area here in the Shawnee National Forest. And I will provide some links below in this, this description. Kind of talks about this place a little bit. It's a uh, historical spot where the uh, Underground Railroad took place. So slaves would meet here to uh, flee their captives. And uh, it's had some really cool history, this whole area that it does. Nearby Sand Cave, Miller's Grove, all that stuff. So do check out the information below to uh, learn more about that struggle. And we'll check out Crow Knob. Alrighty folks, here on top of Crow Knob really cool cool area big bluffs kind of an overlook in a way pretty cool yeah Love, love it out here and the sun's out yeah sun is out feels good short sleeves shorts and in, in February <laughs> and look we have here folks apparently we're not the only ones that want to get out into the sun I believe it's a racer He's just hanging out, getting him some sun. Ugh. Just getting him some sun. <laughs> Watching me. Non venomous, but still, no one needs to be handling any snakes. So, found this pond with a little dock on it <laughs> out in the middle of the forest. <laughs> Thought it was kind of interesting. There you have it, a little, little dock on a tiny little water hole. If you can hear all that, it's birds. It's all birds. That's a whole lot of birds. More bird fun. It's 
things are crazy. We're just following them. Hiking with the birds. Hiking with birds. Wow. Alrighty folks, it seems we have escaped the birds. Come across this little creek area. It's a really pretty creek. And the trail's getting kind of wet. Got waterproof shoes on so it's not too bad but still kind of neat just a neat little area love the creek and we're gonna make our way to miller grove cemetery all right here's a little waterfall something special but still pretty little area very pretty all righty folks here at a creek, very pretty creek. It's uh, I'm going off trail right now. I'm gonna go up this hill, probably a couple more, <laughs> and find uh, Miller's Grove Cemetery. That's why we're going off trail because the trail that apparently went to it is no longer visible. So that's what we're doing. Alrighty, folks. So we went quite a few different routes to get here. Got turned around how to go up and down hills and finally come up to some boundary signs and started looking around and voila big tombstone so here's the cemetery miller grove cemetery uh, these folks are all african-americans probably a lot of them originated from slave slave days and uh it's kind of a interesting little history lesson we got well they died uh in the 1900s miller bedford miller father and abby gill miller mother We got Franklin Sides and his wife, Carolyn. That is a very cool tombstone. It resembles a uh, like a log. That's interesting. That's very neat. I've never seen anything like that. That's pretty neat. Has some leaves there imprinted into it that is really cool very neat very cool area all righty folks came upon this area looks like it's a soon to be trailhead of sorts maybe um Plenty of little parking areas over here. This thing's tied up. I don't know exactly what that's supposed to be. Maybe someone could tell me. It's definitely not a horse high line because it'd be hard to tie the ropes up there. Plus you bring a step ladder or something. Little camping area. And a little pond out here. So, kind of neat. Neat little area. Kind of reminds you of like a little park. You find a lot of strange things in the forest. And then you think, well, you know, that's strange, but it's, it's, it's natural. Like weird looking rock formations and, and strange trees and animals being strange and then you find the other strange things where you're like really <laughs> i mean who's gonna be able to use that toilet paper right there come on 
But I gotta say, it's a nice view while you're, you know, taking a poop. <laughs>